Craig. I'm KB Tamlin. And I'm Tucker Roth. And we were honored to be selected to give this year's senior speech. But first, we need to thank some very important people. Without these people, we wouldn't be here today. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for being here to celebrate with the graduating class of 2024, the largest graduating class in Valley Christian history. It is an honor to share this accomplishment with each teacher, staff member, and all the friends and families that have impacted each of the students here tonight. I can speak on behalf of the entire class when I express my gratitude for the supportive community that makes up Valley Christian Schools. It goes without saying that each of these people have played a large role in the lives of us students and we would like to take a moment to intentionally thank you. To all the teachers, thank you for dedicating countless hours of your time to help us not only excel in our academics, but also in our growth as followers of Christ. We are truly blessed to have such an amazing selection of leaders that want the, truly the best for our students. You have set some of, some of the greatest examples of what it means to put our faith into action. Thank you to our parents for your unconditional love and support throughout our entire lives, but specifically in these last four years. From your decision to send us to Valley Christian to the countless drives back and forth from school, it would have been impossible to be here without you. We recognize the continual sacrifices you've made so that we could achieve all of our accomplishments, and we hope that tonight is a reflection of our gratitude for all you've done. A special appreciation goes out to Mr. Rugg. You took on teaching at Valley Christian the same year that we, as a class, entered the school. We walked with you through the wonderful class of computer literacy, and we now witness you leading our school as the principal. The man you are through Christ is without a doubt something that we all admire, mm. we, and we owe you a tremendous thanks to you for all that you do. To Woo. our peers, the class of 2024, it has been more than an honor growing with each and every one of you. We have experienced it all together, from rigorous classes and assignments to sporting events and enjoying the drama and fun of finding a date to school dances. I could not have chosen a better group of people to have made these memories with that will surely last a lifetime. From our wonderful memories to our accomplishments made, there is no doubt that we have left a lasting legacy at Valley Christian. Let us not take for granted all that we have experienced these last four years. As we celebrate tonight, we recognize the end of our adolescence and begin to embrace adulthood. Take what you've learned, the big lessons and the small, and use them towards your future success. The Lord has worked in countless ways throughout our lives during this time, and we praise him for all he's done. Now let's go back to the beginning of senior year when we took off a few days of school and headed up north for a retreat we call senior kickoff. While the rest of campus was busy transitioning into the new school year, the class of 2024 was coming up with a vision for the year and how we would best lead the grades beneath us. We came together as a class and came up with ideas for ways in which we would be remembered by the school. Each idea stemmed from the desire to reflect God's love in every aspect of our lives. He can, he will, watch him. That was our phrase that we lived by this past year and was the backbone of the goals that we came up with. Three of the class goals this year consisted of respecting and leading in chapel, investing in those younger than us, and showing up for, with spirit for all our school events. We hope to have brought about a positive change in the atmosphere of Valley Christian this year and for the years to come. One, respecting and leading in chapel. As seniors sitting in the front of chapel, it was important for us as a class to demonstrate what it looked like to give God our best, and not only how we presented ourselves, but also how we prepared ourselves to take in God's word. We dress up in our Sunday best each week. We post a playlist of worship sets on Instagram to get students engaged in worship. We sat with purpose in the front row and engaged in the message while also taking turns praying at the end of each chapel. We also made it a goal to bring our Bibles to chapel each week, demonstrating that a faith in God requires work. This faith in action is what I encourage all of you, the class of 2024, to do as you move on to the next season of life. Number two, investing in the lives of those younger than us. The senior class wanted to invest in the classes below us because we remember what it is like looking up to the upperclassmen. We intentionally invested in those younger than us by leading team devotions, inviting them to hang out outside of school, and by sending groups of seniors to the K-8 campuses to share sermons, lead art classes, and show spirit at our K-8 homecoming assemblies. Investment in those who are younger than us has to go beyond our time here at Valley. Use what you've learned, how to listen intentionally, and how to lead by example, to show the generation behind us what it means to be a light in the world. They, they, look, they do look up to each and every one of us and they'll watch what we do. So let that be something that furthers the kingdom of heaven. Number three, showing up in spirit for all of our school events. The atmosphere of Valley Christian would not be the same without our incredible school spirit. 
At the beginning of the year, we made it a point to bleed Victory Blue at school events. Whether it was a blue crew going all out at our three state championship games this year, worshiping with all of our hearts in chapel, or using our gifts and talents in the fine arts, robotics, or even in the classroom, we showed up to support one another in our best school spirit. As you go into this next season of life, I want you to keep showing up and showing spirit. Cheer on one another as you experience the greatest successes of your lives, your, your future work endeavors, marriages, and your kids. Support each other as you go through some of the biggest losses of your lives, losing your loved ones, experiencing heartbreak, and more. We are a Valley family. We want to see you to, to continue to live out this community of support as you go into this next season of life. These three goals of our senior class were not only impactful to us this year, but should also influence how we continue to live. Now that we're all here, and whether or not you've grown up all in these classes for years, at least you have a high school diploma now. So oh, that's, that's great. great. <laughs> in all seriousness, in class of 2024, you've done it. You began high school in an unsure season of COVID and mask wearing, fought through a second loss our sophomore year in Trojan tournament, broadened our perspective on world religions our junior year, as well as remaining locked in during chemistry, learning about why it can be harmful to ingest chemicals during a lab. Finally, <laughs> this year, we proved we can live out Valley Christian's mission statement of being culture changes for Christ, not only on our campus, but in our community. We take all these accomplishments and lessons we learned with us as we leave this school and conquer the, goal, and conquer the goals we have for our future. Thank you to Valley Christian for equipping us to be culture changers for Christ. By delivering academic excellence. Facilitating spiritual growth. And building lifelong community. We owe gratitude to you, our school, for the education through faith that we have all received. Thank you faculty and staff for all that you've done and to our parents. You mean the world to us. Class of 2024, congratulations, congratulations you, you made, made it. it.